50 plus years since independence, the death penalty is still in existence in Kenya's criminal justice system, albeit without executions. In a report finding dubbed Living with a Death Sentence in Kenya on a punishment that has died out of practice, the penalty is said to have yielded large numbers of inmates in under-resourced prisons that compound to psychological stress. It is a punishment that denies all hope as you live in constant fear of being killed year in, year out. This is coupled with the poor detention conditions, methods of execution, and the psychological distress that accompanies a death sentence. Speaking during a launch of the report, KNCHR Chairperson Rosalind Odede has said the inhumane and irreversible miscarriage of justice leads to a possible killing of innocent people due to poor legal representation. Death penalty is, is irreversible once it is meted out. Evidence has indicated that there has been instances of miscarriage of justice and this normally occurs and it's possible to kill innocent people. Further, the commission has outlined the penalty's discriminatory nature and incompatibility with rehabilitation. The practice is a denial of the capacity for reintegration and rehab rehabilitation of offenders. Its application is discriminatory and targets those from disadvantaged backgrounds who cannot, in most instances, afford good legal representations, have poor knowledge of the legal system. In 2017, the Supreme Court declared mandatory death penalty for murder unconstitutional, though as of 2021, 601 people were on death row, while 14 others on death sentence. Currently, approximately 600 prisoners are on death row, but whose sentence has been commuted to life imprisonment. Bentura Komboka, K24, Nairobi.